Hey everybody, Pastor Earhart back here for Small Catechism Tuesday, although I know that it's Wednesday, uh, sometimes Tuesday's schedule gets pretty filled up, and I wasn't able to make it here uh, yesterday to, uh, to record a live video on the Small Catechism, so you're getting it today. So happy Small Catechism Tuesday, a day late on a Wednesday. Uh, we're sticking in the First Commandment again uh, this week. Uh, we're still uh, on uh, the foundation for the rest of the commandments. And today, uh, let's discuss how the First Commandment is foundational for all good works. Again, uh, the First Commandment, you shall have no other gods, uh, is explained by the Small Catechism thusly. What does this mean? We should fear, love, and trust in God above all things. These three things are what make up a God. Anything that you fear, anything that you love, or anything that you trust in ultimately is a God. If you fear something more than God, you've created a false God. If you love something more than God, you've created a false God. And if you trust something more than God, you've created a false God. And so the first commandment really is a commandment about faith uh, and how it plays out in both fear of God's judgment, fear of his wrath, but also love for him and the promises that he gives to us and the mercy he extends to us. Now, the first commandment is the foundation for all of the other commandments. Um, every other commandment is really just a commentary on the first. So, for instance, the commandment, you shall not steal, the seventh commandment, deals with uh, possessions and property and money. And if we steal... Uh, money, for instance, we've put that above God, the love of money uh, above God, and we've created then a false God. Um, in fact, the large catechism calls uh, money and the love of money uh, one of the most common false gods there is. And so every commandment uh, depends on the first. If you break any commandment, you've broken the first commandment. Um, and in that way, the commandments, uh, first commandment sets the foundation for the rest. But at the same time, the first commandment also sets the foundation for all good works. Um, in addition to um, breaking the first commandment whenever you break any other commandments, if you truly keep the first commandment, you've kept all of the other commandments as well. If you keep God first and foremost as the only God, fear, love, and trust in him above all things, then all of the rest of the commandments fall into place. This is what St. Paul is getting at in, uh, in Romans uh, 14, verse 23, when uh, he writes that anything that does not proceed from faith is a sin. So if faith is absent, no matter how good your works are externally, no matter how good they are in, in social uh, situations or in the civil realm, uh, they're not truly good works. Because if they flow from a sinful nature, if they flow from disbelief in God, if they flow from trying to create another God, they are sinful works, no matter what they look like on the outside. But then conversely, whatever does proceed from faith is sanctification is a good work. So, with faith, then everything really becomes a good work. Anything that, everything that does not proceed from sin is a good work if it comes from faith. Uh, and this includes the most mundane, um, simple works of life, uh, works in your various vocations, um, works that serve your neighbors, even if they're not uh, flashy external works, even if you don't get written up in the newspaper or uh, put on TV for doing them, they are still good works because they are works that proceed from faith. So in this way, the first commandment is not only foundational for all of the other commandments, but it is also foundational for all good works. All right, so we'll see you back here in less than a week now, hopefully next Tuesday for Small Catechism Tuesday. Um, I think we'll uh, move into the, the second commandment uh, at that time. So hope, 
hopefully see you all back here next Tuesday for Small Catechism Tuesday once again as we continue on in the Ten Commandments. Take care, everyone, and God bless.